Good morning, we are in day two in Bali. As you can see yesterday, I'm pretty much probably going to be splitting most of these videos up between more than one video because as you can see, I'm gonna be here for a very a long time. So there's gonna be so much stuff that I want to show you all, show you exactly what it is to actually be in Bali. I know I'm probably looking up here, but the screen is right here. So I probably need to look right here. But anyway, so we are in day two right now. We are going to have a tropical, um, a tropical floating breakfast party. So as you can see, all of the ladies are gonna be uh, dressed up in their tropical gear, their tropical bathing suit, their tropical outfits. We're going to have a floating breakfast here at one of the villas. As you can see, I did post two different villas in one. There's two villas in one, so you'll see it change colors between the different villas, but this is actually uh, two villas in one. They're literally right next to each other and they look exactly the same. So yeah, uh, we're going to have a floating breakfast party this morning and then after that, my group will be going to um, the elephant sanctuary. So we'll be doing that and then the other group is going to the spa and then we'll trade off and do the opposite tomorrow. So I'm definitely gonna be taking y'all along the ride. Um, I know a lot of people wanna know like, what are you doing? How did you plan this? Who are you with? I'm actually here solo. Um, I met a travel influencer on Instagram and she actually plans different escapes like this and different trips like this. So when I saw that she was posting um, another Bali sequel, cause she did one before, so she did like a second Bali trip. I was like, oh yeah, I have to go. None of my friends were able to go, which is perfectly fine. Cause I do travel with a lot of my friends and I know that they're usually down for the party, but of course, Everybody is different. They couldn't make it this time. So I was like, you know what? I'm going solo. So that's why I'm here. I am with a travel group. I'm going to put all of her information down in the description box below. It's called, the travel group is called Chitty Ashley Travels. I'm going to link her social media down below. I'm telling y'all, superb. Okay, literally the best service that I have received and I've only been here for two days. I mean, she's very thorough, very uh, well organized. She keeps you up to date with her, um, her team. Everybody is just amazing and I'm having the time of my life already. And even the girls that are here, Complete strangers, but you can't tell. Watch, you're gonna see how we interacting with each other. But yeah, I just wanted to give y'all that little spill before we get started with the party. And I'm gonna be inserting clips in. I might not talk too much, but you know, we're gonna, we're gonna do a little something, something. This is what I'm working with right now. So yeah, I will catch y'all later. Living it up in Bali. You've been here for a year. year. 
She's been here for a year. She's one of the coordinators of the trip. Thank you. Okay. You put down the table and you change your underwear, yeah? Okay. Earrings. Yes. Okay. I come back again, yeah? Okay, thank you. You guys, I just had the best massage ever. As you can see, I'm coming to you raw as is. This was something that I was definitely really excited about. Coming to Bali and getting a full massage. And she did a great job. As you can see, I'm all down. I feel rejuvenated. I'm about to do the um, flower bath now. So I'm going to be inserting clips so that y'all can see it. And I'll insert as well the information below of where I am because... I just feel so rejuvenated right now. It felt so good. I'm definitely gonna leave her a big tip. And that's one thing that I can definitely say is getting a massage back home and getting a massage out of the country is just two different, completely different things. Like every time I go out of the country and I get a massage, it just is so much better than getting a massage back home. So definitely if you go on vacation, make sure you go down to the spa and go get a massage because it's just, it's so different. Like they're more, more in tune um, with the massages and the the therapeutic aroma of being in an actual spa. So yeah, I'm gonna show y'all around, and I'm probably gonna prop this up so we can do the spa bath. And um, yeah, let's get to it. Okay.
Okay, so now we uh, have a look to uh, the farm. Oops. Yeah, so here is the farm uh, called uh, Sartria. So here is uh, where the people they grow a coffee. Yeah, like this one is called uh, Robusta. Yeah, Robusta coffee. Yeah, so uh, now it's uh, no more coffee season. Uh. Yeah, no more coffee season. And then uh, here is uh, vanilla. Yeah, if you never seen vanilla port, yeah, this is vanilla? a vanilla. Vanilla, yeah. yeah. Here is a vanilla. Oh, wow. Yeah, where the people to get vanilla port, yeah. Vanilla port normally come out oh. from here. Yeah, so uh, vanilla in Bali very expensive. Really? Yeah, very expensive. That's the only so that's kind way, I like. So that's very uh, difficult uh, to grow. Yeah, oh, but I here see. they uh, have uh, vanilla coffee. I like yeah, so they mix a coffee and uh, vanilla. vanilla. Yeah, okay. so coconut coffee. Yeah, they have and yeah, this one also uh, robusta coffee. And then uh, this one. Yeah, so here is a cocoa. Yeah, this is a cocoa tree. It's the cocoa tree. Yeah, called, you know, cocoa tree uh, where uh, people get uh, chocolate. Yeah, uh, cocoa beans. Oh, okay. Uh, cocoa beans are from here. Yeah, so this one. Yeah, is a oh. cocoa tree. Yeah, so later you can uh, uh, try. Yeah, uh, to drink. Uh, uh, fresh uh, chocolate, chocolate, yeah, yeah. Or pure, uh, a pure okay. chocolate. Yeah, later you can uh, uh, bring it right here. Okay. And then the ginseng, yeah, ginseng. They grow ginseng. ginseng here. Yeah, this is the ginseng. Yeah, ginseng. They also mix with the coffee. I never had yeah, heard of that so, before. Oh, the ginseng is very good. Yeah, that's good for uh, health. Oh, good. Yeah, very okay. Good for health. I have to try that one. Yeah. So, now nah, look at the here. Yeah, the coffee. Now they start, uh, you know, with uh, little okay. beans. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, look at right here. Yeah, this is will be a coffee bean. Oh wow! Yeah, only every uh, June, July, yeah, is mm -hmm. the time to harvest the coffee. Oh in, okay. Uh, Bali. That's a coffee season yeah, between uh, June and July. Okay. Very yeah, informative. So they grow fine. Uh, civet cat, yeah, civet cat or uh, mongoose. Yeah. Need to eat the coffee bean. Oh yeah, so coffee really? Coffee beans, and then uh, the full of this uh, cat will be a, a coffee bean. Yeah. Oh, so really? Coffee, uh, you know, digested by yeah. this animal. Oh. Yeah. Oh. And that cat brings yeah. more caffeine. So they bring uh, no to reduce the caffeine. Yeah, taste of the coffee really yes. smooth. Yeah, and then the smell is like uh, espresso. This is the animal. Yeah. So later you can uh, so see the poop, process right there. So his poop makes. Yeah, the poop uh, makes a good uh, taste of the coffee. Ooh. But they do a lot of process. Yeah, a lot yes, of process. Of they clean yeah. and then uh, they dry. Oh. Yeah, and then uh, uh, before they roast. Yeah. So what later. Kind of, what kind of? What is that? Uh, a luwak. A luwak. Luwak. Yeah. Ah. Luwak or a civet cat. Silver cat. Silver yeah, cat. Silver cat. Yeah. So now you will see uh, the poop of this uh, animal. Okay. Collecting from the farm. Yeah, the poop of this uh, cat yeah, will be like this one. Yeah, you know the coffee. Yeah, the coffee beans are still uh, protected by the shell. Yeah, so coffee. Uh, so coffee it's beans clean. Are, yeah, okay, because it comes so out very cold. Clean, yeah. Yeah, only uh, taste of this coffee are yeah, really uh, smooth. Yeah, really uh, the smell like espresso. Yeah, but the oh, coffee okay. is a less uh, caffeine. Oh, yeah, nice. so coffee is less caffeine. So in Bali, this is the most expensive coffee. Oh, oh. Yeah, the coffee uh, are roasting right there, and then uh, they use a special uh, equipment. Yeah, this is for oh. uh, grind. Yeah, yeah, this is for grinding the coffee. Yeah, like this one. Yeah, and then the sieve it, yeah, for uh, uh, the coffee uh, instant, yeah. Oh, yeah, for okay. Instant coffee. Here is Kiana trying poo poo coffee. Poo coffee from the silver cat. Okay, here I go. Yes. Yeah, it it's, tastes like espresso black yes, coffee. Yeah, Starbucks. it's good. It's I don't smooth. drink my coffee black though, so I would. You would. You need a sugar. Cream, a little bit of green yeah. and sugar, or a little vanilla or something inside of it. Oh, look at me in my roomie. Hi y'all. We having so much fun. It's my birthday trip. Yes. <laughs> Meanwhile, why is she in my closet copying me? <laughs> Here. Beautiful.
on the group chat and then we always like oh let's leave from LA right, right. and then she's from LA he's from LA yeah. she's from Philly I'm from Florida so clearly we yellow. nothing was planned and we end up being me and Precious end up being roommates and then E ended up being our sweet mate because she's on the other side of, uh, of our um of our room so it's just so crazy because all the girls here think that we knew each other pre previously and we didn't <laughs> like that's how you just know that our personality just literally just clicked 